Hallo. Ich heiße Rüdlen und willkommen auf meinem ASMR Kanal. Today I am finally 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 making an ASMR video on the book I bought a while ago in German. This is the largest book I have got ever, I think, both to its size and its weight. This is the art of Blizzard Entertainment. When I got this book, I had no idea that it was in German because there is also this book in English and unfortunately the seller who did this listing second hand did not say it was in German so I do really love this book it has a lot, a lot of great art and I'm really thankful to have been doing some basic German studies during my days in school so I think I will be able to read some of the text for you and make it really nice I really hope you will enjoy this video and to all my German listeners I'm German is not even my third language I just know the basics so I hope you can forgive me if I pronounce something wrong but let's get into this video I hope you will sit back and relax and enjoy both my English and German soft spoken ASMR content thank you as you might see I have already started decorating my home for Easter so I have this lovely, lovely, lovely tablecloth with Easter chickens on them that I love but here is the book and unfortunately this will be the only angle I can film this book in The Heart of Blizzard Entertainment Diablo, Wolfocraft, Starcraft I've been going through this book a little and the artwork is simply amazing here we can see in grey and white the picture of the burning crusade with Illida and Lady Vash. Let's just read a little bit. Blizzard Entertainment hat die Spielebranche für immer verändert. The text is a little bit too small for me to read right now. The art of Blizzard Entertainment. And the first picture is from Diablo. this beautiful scenery and some from Starcraft and the old local in Nalt, Vorwort Einleitung und auf Okra Diablo, Starcraft, Spiele, die nie realisiert würden, Spass muss sein, Künstler, wer sich Hier are some introductions. 
action words for fort. We are going to skip some of these very long texts from the creators of Blizzard and the creators of this book. It's about their how they started with gaming and buying PCs. Oh no. Unfortunately, I can't read this introduction page about World of Warcraft and all. I can't read since they printed a grey text on a brown background. It's easier down at the bottom. But it's really odd. Let's read a bit at the bottom. In Blaufeder and weekly on World of Warcraft, the balance vision. Dutzenden individuelle Rassen und Kulturen zu wahren, war keine leichte Aufgabe. Die Rassen von Warcraft mussten auf den ersten Blick markant sein und ihre individuellen Gesch Geschichten und Werte vermitteln. Gleichzeitig aber auch aufeinander abgestimmt sein. Die Rassen, die die Allianz und die Hort bilden, würden so ausgewählt, dass sie bestimmen, wachsen der jeweiligen Fraktion widerspiegeln. I don't know who decided to print grey and brown, but that is not good. And there is a really nice older concept art of the warship Thrall of the Horde. Look at this beautiful old artwork. You can actually see the high elves that were supposed to be a part of the Alliance already from the start so the dwarves, the humans, and the high elves and there are some torrents, trolls, and orcs The orcs and the mansion bekriegen sich Deise seine Bild im den die brennende Lydien von Himmel stürz wer sind plötzlich auf Vollkommene Wiese alles, was Warcraft 3 ausmacht. Sam hat sich in seinem Büro versandt und kam dann mit diesen Bildern wieder raus, die so ikonisch sind und so perfekt darstellen, in welche Richtung bekommen. Die Wiese Spiel lässtlich sein. Salt. Here is a mode work of the nine elves and scenarios in the middle of the war of the undeads. Here is that picture that was in the beginning in grey. I was talking. With the Lydon Stormbridge, Kyle Fast, and Lady Wash. This book has some really, really beautiful artwork that I greatly enjoy. And the Lich King, Arthur's Menace. Schließlich sie und ihre einzelnen Künstlerteams dann mit der Arbeit an einer Rasse fertig. Die Charaktere sind 
ausgestaltet und animiert, die Gebäude texturiert und in der Umgebung platziert. Und alles ist da, wo es sein soll. Dann reichen wir das Ganze an unsere Illustrationen weiter, damit sie darauf so etwas wie da hier machen. Erst als wir dieses Bild sahen, fühlte sich die Burgenrasse zum ersten Mal wirklich lebendig an. See that my camera has a little bit of issues with focusing on the darker pages. Where is some of the really old art from World of Warcraft? I really enjoy how the art has developed during the years of Blizzard Entertainment. It has gone from a really cartoonish style to uh, quite realistic, and now we're all back to cartoonish. The death of Hell's Grim. I think all of these are painted by Metzan. Chris Metzan. This is back from 1995. They have so much older like really basic concept art and most of it comes from Chris Madsen I'm really happy he's back on the team for World of Warcraft Sich Ressourcen zu beschaffen Gold, Öl, was immer man brach um seine Flotten zu versorgen dieses Bilddynamik macht einen großen Teil von Warcraft 2 aus. Es ist komisch, sich das jetzt anzusehen. Moving to cut out a bit, my neighbors are starting to do something, I don't know what. Here are some of the concepts art for the early demons and the couple of crazy to see how old that this does not even have the feeling of World of Warcraft in my opinion. And there are some of the torrents in older mind. Ich habe dieses erste Taurenbild immer geliebt. Sami hat ihre Körpermasse und wilde Wildheit hier wirklich perfekt eingefangen. This is the definition des Tauren. This is pretty graphic. The orc is holding a decapitated human hand. Oh, look, here we see then some concept art of the fur box. Really, from really a long time back ago. Oh, look. This is my favorite racing game. Eines unserer ersten Bilder von einem zweiköpfigen Ogre. Our first artwork of the two-handed Ogre. Maybe this is Nersul. some really really old artwork of the demons and the satyrs. These people are amazing. Who did the World of Warcraft universe? Some more of the orcs. 
they used to look so like thick and big more chunky than ripped to be quite honest here is even a work monk artwork I think they actually thought about making monks even back in the day so I don't know why people got so bothered or remiss of Pantaria. It was a bit childish with pandas, but I do love that expansion, it was so good. Here we are a bit lowered, but it might be Manoroth. And the centaurs. That looks very rough. But I love that about them. I don't quite enjoy how they made them so civilized in Dragonflight, but that's just me. Oh look, here is some more of Chris Metzen's artwork, but it might be Kill Jaden, right? Or Archimond. Some Thorin Druid Priestess, maybe. Corona or Forken and the female troll Venishine English figure male male Masish Mirimer Vidar Anoran Tasi Amar Ende Ausit Ikonan in Hainan Aben Clayed Aben Als is that ranking the weiblichen gegenstücke zu unserem menschlichen horde charakteren zu sichnen hat sich meine schwäße als stärke erweisen i can hear in my head that my German is not what it once was, but that's okay. I think it's also very comforting hearing my own mother language, Swedish, spoken by someone that does not know how it's supposed to sound. Here are some of the gnolls. These are the Ariston Sage. Nungen för ditt nolle. Det är just en konceptskissen för vår kraft 3. Nu är mer genvälje. Vi kör in i hintergrundshaben. Använde fanden siren väg så av. Som mot den trendlor. And the troll Germans. This old artwork does something for me. It's like stepping into a time portal. I really, really enjoy it. And here are the harpies and the naga. abominations and the scarabs. I feel like maybe this book they used put it all in in no particular order scenario or scenarios and Dillidon Storm Rage the first thing Is this maybe Lady Vash before her Naga transformation? And then Mereren from the graffiti, the Daver Sishnet and Tins Papiri Gerisht Wurden. Erkent man, das man ein Bild von Mürzen vor sich hat. Und wenn jemand daraus schwarze Stiefel trägt, kann es 
I can already see that this is a cover for some of the comic books they made back in the day. Does this does cover the Zerstan romance? Then we will ever endlich haben. Endlich bekommen wir in Warcraft mal Abenteurer zu Gesicht. I used to read all of the old comics when I was younger, when they came out they were full craft mangas as well look, here's a dwarf fighting a orc monk maybe and this is eines meiner liebsten Werke überhaupt es heißt Duell am Donnergrad und siegt nicht nur meine Bienen Lieblingsrassen, Zwerge und Orks, sondern auch meine Bienen Lieblingseltern aus Warcraft 3. Des Bergkönig und des Klingemeister. Die Armeen und all das andere Militärische drumherum sind fort. Hier geht es sehr um zwei Krieger die gegeneinander kämpfen, um zu sehen, wer der Überlängene ist. Der Zweig hat zwar das erste Blut vergossen, aber der Ork hat seinen Hammer an zwei gehackt. I do wish these books would make bigger text. Here is also another cover. This is more of a cover des ersten Rollspielenbusch. So this was from a role playbook. Das wir raus, wir rausgebracht haben. Da war Warcraft 3 gerade auf den Markt gekommen und die brennende Legion, die Mann im Hintergrund, das Bild sich sieht war dementsprechend seiner Seite der große Fiend und um unserem Franchise. I have been looking at one of the role-playing books. That is quite expensive. I think it's from Vanilla Waterfall Craft. And it goes for like sixty dollars here in Sweden, but it's hard to find. Here are some of the original concepts for Dalaran, when Dalaran still used to be in the hinterlands. And here's the crater after the the mages lifted the city. Das ist weist von Kunst. Sita ist bei Blizzard nicht mehr, wie, wie es mal war. So, this is fan art. Not made by Blizzard. I think it's actually. The leader of the dwarves. And my favorite character ever in Burfogroth. This is beautiful. This is the artwork they made on one of the TCG packs. I made an ASMR video quite a while ago. So they used this artwork for Heroes of Azeroth. The TCG expansion and battle pack set. So it's a human mage, an orc warrior fighting in probably Alderac Valley. Some more of Thrall. This do remember, and this might be from Cataclysm when he got that green Jesus gear. 
and some more satyrs Some of the maps Cosmodon, Lord Daron And Teldrassil Das Bild von Teldrassil Den Storte Gabe der Naschelfe Im Spiel gewinnt man nicht wirklich den visuellen Eindruck, dass diese ganze Zone mitsamt ihren Bergen und Wäldern in einem riesigen Baum gehört, das alle innerhalb der Grenzen dieses gewaltigen Baums liegt. Here are some of the races and classic dwarves, another dwarf, human, no, more dwarves, nine elves, dwarf. No, it is really iconic, loading screen from Manila, World of Warcraft, truly beautiful art. And here is some mix. The Arakoas from the Burning Crusade, and here is the Tanukas from Wrath of the Lich King, Stormwind City, the Exodar, here is Crystal Song Forest from the Wrath of the Lich King expansion. So it's all quite mixed up. I think this is from the Goblin Starter Zone as well. This book is just filled with art. And we're still used on the World of Warcraft section. Silvanas, the Therals. Ein weiblicher Ork von zwei. Eines der wenigen Bilder, die es von Orkfrauen gibt. Here's some of the concept art of Stranglethorn Veil. I know they also use that for Earthstone. Here's a cute picture of the Torrens and the Orcs helping some blood elf children. This is a really big book and we're gonna be here all day if we should go through every single picture The dark portal Blood mist style I think And this lovely blood elf female paladin picture I remember I always wanted this as a poster as a child This is also very iconic. The Night Elf Hunter finding the Blood Elf Folk. This would be very good to make a 3D resin print on. Planning on starting doing models in Blender and 3D printing them. This would be a really cool project with a really dynamic. This artwork actually has a figure already made from it. It's the Blood Elf female versus the Draenei male, but it's also Valeria versus Murat. And you can find this as a really large figurine that goes for like between one thousand to two thousand dollars on eBay. It was a limited figure. And the Prophet Elf. Here is a morph mirror. Glens build with the kniden. Dranai is to vermish no shimmer eine. The ultimativen tars the lungen eines Dranai paladin. It 
this was also a cover for a book I think it was Night of the Dragon or Night of the Twilight or something like that, Twilight of the Dragons so more of the drama is Antilidum Storm Rage very very There is this build for Nilidan. Das ist ja mehr lila als bei Prinz. Ich fand cool, dass es diesen Kontrast zwischen seiner dunklen und seiner hellen Seite sieht. So here is from The Burning Crusade. I wonder if a lot of this artwork we're going through I've already made in my previous art books videos for World of Warcraft from the collector's editions. This print with the Kael'thas and Gil'jaden I had from the 15 year anniversary prints. And this very beautiful promo art. I got a really big retro poster with this one but I had to sell it off it did not fit the room unfortunately here we can see Kael'thas with the ashes of Valar in the background Arthas Menethil with the invincible Dirken in Mitartas als baby das hier würde für nicht im Spiel sein angefertigt und das Bild ist ziemlich groß aber es zeigt, dass wir alle brav und jung und unschuldig anfangen und dann wird man zum Licht gehen so here is from Wrath of the Lich King some in Ragosa and when Northas rose in Ragosa from the grave this very nice Lich King artwork Ich finde, die ist unser coolest Bild vom Lich König einfach Will hier so viel Darth Vader drin steckt. Here is some of the. What do you call? No face on face. I can't remember. The minions of the old god. Here are some of the goblins. It was such a shame the path they took with Savannah's Rind Runner after Battle for Azeroth or even during that expansion. They should have used Stop the Man. The Death Knights. Here is Teleron floating. some of the armor pieces from Cataclysm I recommend because these are like gear gear I used to have on my rogue he really enjoyed it but I know a lot of people didn't but up to this day I really enjoyed that artwork and gear some of the Peladin gear from Firelands Orcs 
Untote, Blutelfen, Hort, Tauren, Koblenz, Trolle, Verklassen, Allianz, Drenai, Sverge, Vorgen, Mo, Nastelven, Pandaren, Menschen. More of the Goblin artwork. I would have loved the Goblins to say, stay a third neutral faction. The Goblins are fueled by money and greed, so I don't think they should have alliance themselves with the Org. Some of the Organs as well. Gel burning. Here is Uldum. And Bashir. Down in the water rain. This is the picture from the book about Thrall, the Doom Hammer book. This is Bill Vastar Conver. For ein, eine Münzere Romane. Weltenbeben. Ich finde, es ist eines der ikonischsten Bilder, die wir hier für Warcraft gemacht haben. Das Hammer als das Symbol der Hort. Der Abgleichgeld auf dem Boden liegt. seen some of him during Dragonflight, some visions, or more in depth about this character. But no. Maybe this is Gromash and Scream. Oh, the Blood Lord Akar. Also one of my favorites from this franchise. I'm really looking forward to making lore videos. I'm just about to start. Just give me some time and it's coming. Here is Garrosh and Scream. The best old character ever. So sad they killed him off. And the Pandarans. Here is from Chris Metzen back in 2003. They had already thought out Master Pandarans. So it was not the uh, April Spruce Yoke with Mist of Pandaria. Most of this book, as you might see, is about World of Warcraft. But that was uh, and have been for almost a 30 year Warcraft, their biggest franchise, understand. Pandarans, male and female. Mitte der neinter Trückblisser mit der Veröffentlichung des Meisterwerks Diablo entscheidend, dass dabei eine neue Ära von Hack- und Slash-Action-Rollenspielen einzulauten. Von der ersten Idee an beschwor Diablo Bilder von Albtraum- Schaften herauf, in denen sich besorgte, gefährliche Bewohner tummeln. In der Führung der brennenden Höllen angeseitelt und schließlich in die hohen Himmel im ermöglichte Diablo den Spieler, zu Helden im ewigen Konflikt zwischen Gut und Böse zu werden. So 
sometimes German has so long words. Both Swedish is based off of the Germanic language tree, but man, sometimes it's hard to read. Some of the witch doctor artwork. I did get Diablo 3 back in the day when it came out, and I remember having the bug, being not able to log in at all and then when I realized they had the real money action house I quit playing the game I did not enjoy it unfortunately some of the really satanic artwork barbarian and maybe some necromancers it's a really cool franchise but the best days were probably back during the first and the second Diablo I have not played at all the fourth but I have read that a lot of players has not been happy with the game I read about the, what was it? 60 or 70 dollar amount you could buy in game players are not happy about that at all it's a lot of beautiful artwork but still it's hard as a person that does not enjoy Diablo get any nostalgia from these artworks some of the enemies but it's still fun to view the different monsters and bosses and artwork from the different blizzards Desert Wasp I really wish Blizzard could go back to not being so greedy and having all these loot box systems and in-game shops Nu först protokoll ta sin verdamt lange augen bra Augenbrauen hören aber wirklich nie auf zu waschen. It's really cool. Some of the from Diablo 3, the Witch Hunter artwork. I remember back in the day that a lot of cosplayers would use this cosplay and just cover themselves in brown paint. I do not think that would be okay to this day to do so some of the really cool demon hunters they were new for that or demon slayers, demon hunters, I can't remember they were new for Diablo 3, right? Demon Jagger, that's a sin, but it's not a sin, the butcher I remember this guy some of the bosses like they have so amazing artwork for a game that I did not enjoy that is such a shame some of the angels two boxes the spider one and the bug one I always wanted to make cosplays even though I don't enjoy the game but man the artwork I saw at BlizzCon during the cosplay competitions they used to have people cosplaying as these characters and 
I think a woman who did a realistic cosplay with the spider legs actually won the first prize. Very, very amazing. Very great artwork. I love how Blizzard can make ladies so sensual, even when they're completely dressed up. Some of the male and female barbarians. Oh my god. the monks the wizards or sorcerers more of the wizards but here's the old work that you can see a lot of concept art for Diablo the big bad guy himself but they made him is like with the dragons from Dragonflight they're looking too skinny I want them to be a big buff grotesque monster not this slender a franchise I really love reading the lore about. I think this is what started my love for Warhammer, is this sci-fi stuff. The Starcraft Universum is the Unsere Interpretation der Klassischen Weltraumopern, eine Story von Kosmischen Ausmarschen, Oller Krieg und Verrat, Teufelausch, Irken wo zwischen all dem Gemetzel gibt er sogar eine liebliche Geschichte. Starcraft ist weit entfernt von der Welt eines Warcraft oder Diablo. Tatsächlich ist es Blister einziges Non-Fantasy-Game, was unseren Künstler eine dringend benötigt. Bestlung von Sword und Sorcery Stil in sehr anderen Welterwirtschaft. So this was Blizzard's only IP that was not focused around sorcery or wizard or magic fantasy. And I'm so sad that they actually never made another Starcraft. But maybe it's for the best. Here is some original artwork that Chris Madsen made back in 1997. It's probably for the best that they didn't make uh, StarCraft 3. Imagine with all of the in-game shops and time-gated content. But it really is a beautiful universe all of the concept art the aliens, the humans all of it, the AIs, the robotics this I used to always dream about as a child to cosplay this alien like figures but really I I don't think anyone has made a cosplay of this ever and it would be so cool to create a realistic face of a mask Der dunkle Templer Viele dieser Elemente finden sich aus Heim modernen Seratel Die grüne Klinge Die Schulterpolster 
an denen diese kleinen Schriftbänder bemerkt. Just look at all of this sci-fi esque inspirations. I really love this kind of futuristic horror. Die sind die Wappen der Wisch, scheint einem Rassen in Starkraft. Das tyrannische Wappen oben fanden wir auch außerkräftig genug, weswegen wird es ihm gegeben, als sie dem anderen nicht mehr verändert. Zwillard Weird grey on dark backgrounds. Just look at this. Oh my god, it's beautiful. It's beautiful, beautiful artwork. Like just sitting here and thinking about what Blizzard Entertainment used to be with the original owners of the company. It is, life goes on, you know, things develop, people change, people grow tired, want something else from life. But being able to do all of this as a passion project is amazing. These are great. These are clips. It is. Something I wish I would have been able to do. I love this kind of high minds. It's like in War I Made the Tyrannoids. How oh, our power to are. Just being this big of a life minds that can overpower whoever. That is such a cool part of this sci fi horror. In my opinion, like this, this book is um, so big, so thick. Here is some um, artwork of Kerrigan. There used to be a lot of cosplayers that didn't like these bodysuits of Kerrigan. That was really amazing. Being able to put down all the effort and money and time. That is really, really amazing. I'm getting such a nostalgia from this. It is, um, having this big smile on my face. There is a lot of the armor or that they thought I would do. Not the ships, but the pieces would look like. I do really love looking at the old art like this. That reminds me of what life used to be. To remember that here and now and the future will bring a lot of happiness, not just the past days. Um, even hard for you to see, not even by the camera angle, but reading this faint grey text on this background is 
Sol challenge. Or this maybe, oh, I think these are projects that I planned on making that never became nomad. Varin hauskesbrosjen ambitioneres action rollen spil concept. Tvasi, tas vir verendre der spetsen, nein der jare and vikelten. I wonder if this was a game that they planned on making nomad. It looks like a mix between Warcraft and maybe Starcraft. Yeah, it, it's such a shame. Blizzard has had so many IPs that they plan on making that never happened. Bloodlines. Bloodlines was a third person action role in Spiel, this and Night Veklung Anfang 1995 began. Das Game war in einem düsteren Science Fiction Setting angesiedelt, in dem die rivalisieren Sektenhäuser, die Wirkel, Welt im Traum Vampire und die Wohnenschaft über ein galaktisches Imperium am Rande sehr zusammenbrüch kämpfen. So, this was also some like Science Fiction Vampiric third-person action role game role-playing game it's so cool looking at what could have been and what never happened wasn't it the project that they actually worked on that they quite recently announced that they're just gonna cancel entirely that they had been working on for like so many years. Denisa, Denison, ein Worten Thematik, Herr Herrer, heitere Spielekonzept. Das Mitte der 90er entweckt Wölder war Denisa, ein Marschalles und jeden zu Kleinholz Action Game. Man könnte es als in Tümlich Mischung ausspielen wie Rampage und Smash TV besiegen. This was also something that did not happen. Ronin. So many games. In Mitte der 1990er als die ursprüngliche Idee von Ronin stand. Das war das Spiel als im Feudal in Japan angesiedeltes Rollspielen gedacht. Allerdings waren wir nicht sein seit noch nicht bereit, in der realen Welt zu leben, nicht einmal in einer so faszinierenden Wirte des Feudal Japans. This was probably a Japanese inspired game. You can see this turtle monster and some samurai looking weapons and characters. Oh, the Spasmus sign. This is too grey. I tried reading this two times off camera and I can't even see the text. Like, look. Can you even see it? It's grey and blue. Maybe if I was a native German reader, that would have been easier, but now I can't even see the letters. Here is some Christmas artwork, I think. Scenarion. And a war. Oh, look. Morgs. Kerrigan. And Diablo. In a very pushed up winter costume, holding a mistletoe. Kerrigan giving a shy some seedlings. And this is really cute. The artwork or World of Warcraft with the troll, not troll, work baby getting a Wolf, really cute. Here we can see 
some artwork of Arthas and Jaina Brownmore sharing some booze during the festive season this kind of stuff always makes me so happy even this cartoonish like Ungesogen und Artig Baufrende this is really cute all of this like I think the characters as children during Christmas. You're gonna need a bigger shiny. A lot of cute Christmas artwork. Mm, Diablo 3. Some of them is still <laughs> Rudolph too. Not Diablo 2. Some of the funny, cute artwork. Tower and Maureen. <laughs> and the Murloc. They can be so creative sometimes with their artworks. It's really nice and fun looking at this. Dwarf and an orc sharing some booze with a Pandaren and giving some spirit. Murlocs. They are. Which one made what dot work? And that was the end. And here on the last page, we can see some Diablo artwork. This one. Long, long book to make. I did a little bit of German reading, and hopefully you enjoy the ASMR sounds. I hope you found this video relaxing. It was very nostalgic and fun for me to go through, but I'm happy to now have done the content I did with all of these books I showed off in a future video project all like four or five months ago so now i'm on to newer projects and i'm happy to start something new 